Alright, hello and welcome everybody to my sniper montage number three. Got uh, a few days worth of footage here, didn't do it all in one night like I did with sniper montage number two. And sad to say, I didn't get quite as many epic shots as I would have liked to have gotten. Um, and I did get on sniper montage number two, I had a few really epic ones there. Also had a couple of uh, collateral damage kills that I didn't get the recording for, so that's also an issue, missed out on those. Anyway, let's get to directing this one, uh, or do a little play-by-play -play here. This guy from out of nowhere decides that he wants a teabag, so, you know, I just put this in here as a comedic clip, have a little fun with it. And, you know, anytime somebody does something to me, I'll get him back tenfold. So, there's that little bit of revenge. <laughs> we got uh, some rogue transmission here. Um, attacking, and uh, our team is definitely hurting a little bit here. But I'm going to do what I can to uh, try and take over this Bravo and cop here. So, I didn't quite get that second guy. LAV got my way, and I shot the LAV instead. But, got him with the pistol. You know, I gotta get that motion sensor down, help out the team. So I look around and I'm like, oh great, there's another person shooting. I think he killed the guy that spawned right behind me. I go around, get a little quick scope on him, get him out of the way. Look over, see there's three guys right there that did not see me at all. I definitely got one of their attention, or the attention from one of them, but uh, anyway, finished him off. Got quite a few quick scopes in, um, on this video, I, I'm, I'm even considering maybe maybe making like a quick scoping montage because I do have quite a few of them here. Another one there. This is a nice little streak here of uh, five kills. T again, attacking uh, at flood zone this time. Uh, and I believe let's see, actually no, it's only four kills because I don't actually get this guy. The other four are all headshots. Uh, I'm just counter sniping for the most part, spotting them before they spot me. Take an easy headshot, but it's basically four and a half kills in uh, 30 seconds or so. So I felt like that was a worthwhile clip. And one last guy again. They didn't. None of them actually saw me, so it made it for made for pretty easy kills there. That guy moved out of the way of the bullet right as it was coming at him. I got him with the second shot. Couldn't get his body though. That actually might be the same guy I'm about to get here in a second, but uh, I'm not sure. It should be somebody else in that room. That was a pretty tough shot to actually see the target. This one's just a simple little headshot. Just took me a second to line it up correctly. There's a slow mo of uh, that that second shot on that clip, though. As you see, it is a pretty small, tough target to see. There. Now this one here, I, it was brilliant first shot and then almost a brilliant second shot, but I didn't have the round chambered yet when I lined him up. And ended up screwing up the, uh, the second guy there. That one there, got the parachuter, didn't quite get the kill. And then took out the uh, driver of the boat there. Another slow mo replay of that. Nice fun little shot right there. Good amount of lead. Oh, caught him right in the head. Another shot at a boat right here. Um, although with the attack boat, you can't shoot the driver, so just got the gunner that time. Now this one, I was pretty sure that this was a collateral at first. I, I, for a good five seconds, I thought that was a collateral, because there actually are two uh, clips there. And I think I did get a hit on the second one. I think I headshot one and, and hit, body hit the other. But uh, didn't get around to finishing off that second guy, so not that amazing. That one right there, that was a little bit lucky. That first shot, he kind of ran into it. Um, I could claim that it was a great prediction at when he would start sprinting, but it was a little bit lucky because I, I let him a little bit too much, and then he sprinted into it. This one here, I honestly just I bailed out of a chopper. I wasn't even doing sniper montage this night or collecting sniper footage. I just happened to be a recon class. Bailed out of a chopper. And it was right at the end of the match, so I said, screw it, I'll do a little bit of sniping. And sure enough, I pulled a 748 meter headshot in the last 30 seconds of the match. So, just was able to pull that clip. And another nice little quick scope and uh, second kill to go with it. Got blocked on the first shot on him, though. Here, I, I had an opportunity to shoot that guy in the air, but I figured it was a way safer shot to just let him 
stand still to line up, uh, or stand still for the, uh, for arming the MCOM. Get him once he's sitting still. There's just, uh, two kills at 400 plus meters. Pretty much back to back, two kills and three bullets. And this, this clip kind of exemplifies it, but, uh, just so you guys know, I'm, I'm gonna be out of town for about two weeks. And uh, I'm uh, going to be on an airplane here in a few hours, so I wanted to get this video done tonight. So I did rush through a little bit of the editing, and actually I could see a little bit of sloppiness here just in this clip, so I do apologize for that. But, um, you know, there, there will be a little bit rougher editing in this than I will usually put in my videos. But anyway, so I got one kill on the roof there. Run up the hill, see there's uh, two guys and a third one spawns, and my teammate takes out one of them, but I dog tag the other two. Hit that guy with a headshot in uh, two shots, and then another guy up here. Get him on the run there with the body shot, and then a second body shot to finish him once he sits still. Well, this one, I didn't even know that sniper existed. I just saw the glare on the scope, so I focused on him. Two shots to drop him. Another guy in the roof, just ready to get picked off. And I missed that shot there by about an inch, but oh well. I got the spot for it. This one's, that first kill was nothing special, but the uh, the second one here is a nice, it's a nice drag it across the person type of thing and pull the trigger at the just the right moment. Now here, I got a hit marker in the first shot. I don't know how that second shot misses, because I was perfectly centered on it. But anyway, so two kills rather quick there. I think you guys are probably seeing the formula of how I put together footage here. Just generally looking for clips of uh, two kills in a short period of time, or one rather nice shot by itself. Uh, two kills or more, I should say, in a short period of time. Anyway, just uh, a couple of nice shots there, long range, and then the um, quick acquisition heads, uh, headshot. Another long range one there at Parcel Storm. That was a nice one there. That was another one where you drag it across the person, pull the trigger just the right moment. A little quick scope there, and then uh, right, it was, you can hear that end of match music, so the match is just about over. And one more headshot. Just barely missed that third one. I actually managed to not die there. Now, here's another comical moment. <laughs> I was going to go up and get that guy's dog tag, and I just put it in there. It's just another comical moment for the video, but um, <laughs> just, I don't know. I figured I'd leave that one in. It was just fun. I hear him terribly overzoomed with the 20x scope, but I uh, still managed to get two kills at rather close range, at least, you know, relatively close for the 20x. Um, just two quick kills here. Nothing all that great there, but, you know, a couple of nice shots. This one is a little camper there in the corner, and before I even take it, a single bullet of damage, I drop him with a headshot. Another one right there is just quick acquisition and dodging the rafters there, so it doesn't bolt doesn't bounce off the metal there. Totally missed that first shot, and then actually probably should have slow mode that shot, but uh, nice little headshot there, in the third bullet. There's a streak that it went on. I was really rushing through these shots for some reason, just not taking a lot of time to line up headshots. Really trying to go quick. Um, so I got three quick kills there. Uh, granted, the first two were two shots each. And, you know, go over, look around, see some more activity over there on the left side. Another two shots to, uh, to drop type of kill. Can't quite get that guy, and I start getting shot at, so do a little bit of moving around. Learned the trick recently that you can actually shoot through the glass on the uh, protected 50 cal guns there, so do one of those headshots, and then uh, another headshot there uh, to finish off the clip. That's actually the only clip right there. It's not the SRR uh, 61. That was the uh, uh, AMR, anti-material rifle. It's one of the special pickups. It's a one-shot kill. But I put an over sh uh, uh, head kill or headshot on it for overkill. Anyway, skip the little clip there. Just do quick kills. Get starting to get shot in the back. Turn a corner and then quick scope. This one, I almost got a third kill in this. I I still don't understand how I missed the third guy. I just cut it out the clip. 
But I, I had two kills there, and I just brought my scope over to the third guy, and I still don't understand how I missed that shot. Oh well, only two. That one there is another quick acquisition. Drop from one shot. Another long range one there. Quick little double kill here. And to finish that guy off with the pistol. There I actually, uh, okay, so I hit the the explosive barrel behind him. I know that now. I did not know that at the time. It was completely an accident. Just a wonderful little accident. But, uh, I, I, once I figured out what happened, I got a good laugh about it. Um, I was still pretty confused at the time as to how I got a double kill there. But then a nice little headshot after a quick acquisition headshot. That one there, <laughs> I think it was uh, a boat underneath me that uh, at the spawn there that had exploded for some reason completely threw off my shot and I still managed to get the kill and uh, another quick kill uh, long range right after a little quick scope there after the uh, parachuter came down another little quick scope a tight little headshot I had to cut that clip short though because I got I got headshot uh, I received a headshot about a half a second after I delivered that one another boat gunner drops there's a fun little clip so there's the grenade kill and a headshot and an assist they didn't quite get him and then the fourth guy dropped him so it was a fast clip of uh, basically three and a half kills two quick kills there another two quick kills here boat gunner sitting still and then the uh, sniper down there Oh, another little quick scope. Got, like I said, I got lots of quick scopes in this video. I just did a whole bunch of them recently, and it was fun to add to the video. Here, I just see that guy from out of nowhere shoot the tank on the first round, but then correct it second round and get him with one shot. Basically, one shot that actually had a chance of hitting him anyway. Uh, quick little double kill there. This one's fun. Got him through the glass with just a nice little lead on him. And here we go. Uh, I did do a top five this week. This is going to be my number five top five of the of the week that I, that I uh, spent collecting this footage. Just real quick with the uh, 20x there, uh, one shot, one kill. As soon as I saw him, I thought that was a really nice shot. Uh, also, major change in elevation. And this one here, you saw there was actually a hit marker on the first shot. It hit the. I got a hit marker on the pilot, but not the kill. So then I go back for the second shot, and I end up taking out one of the passengers on the uh, on the back right side. But it is a headshot, and it is a clean kill. And of course, I die about a tenth of a second later. Uh, number three clip of the week right here, and this is uh, just a quick uh, quick scope tutorial right there, basically. Um, another quick scope tutorial here, coming in at number two for the week. There's one, there's two, there's three, and just missed the fourth guy, but then I ended up taking his tag. So that, I thought that was a great clip. And now the number one clip of the week. Uh, I do hope you guys enjoyed. Actually, I finished this one out just to show that the, uh, the MCARM was successfully destroyed. Last clip of the week. Hope you guys enjoyed the show. We got another MCOM arming here, and a couple of guys want to come up and try to defuse. So I get that first grenade out. Right at the moment I see the second guy, I put the second grenade out. Third guy there, or I'm sorry, second guy with the second shot, third and fourth guy with the collateral damage kill at the end. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I appreciate it. Uh, please hit the like and subscribe. Thanks again. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I appreciate it. Uh, please hit the like and subscribe. Thanks again.